Hi guys and welcome back to Tech Tips of the Day. Today I'm gonna be showing you how to do a boat Ubuntu. Uh, sorry, yeah, Ubuntu and um, Chrome OS in one computer. Well, uh, one disclaimer: it's not really do a booting, but it's actually much better than do a booting. So first of all, you what you want gonna want to do is search up Qten download link. Click on the first GitHub link and open its GitHub page. On the side at the about page, you should see a download call a link called goo.gl slash fd3 cc. The link may change if you're watching this in the future, but just click it and download it. Now if you scroll down, it tells you some um, information about this. But what we are looking for is the command. So copy this command. Uh, I'll paste the command in the description below. And now, oh yeah, before I forget, make sure you have developer mode enabled. And I'll link a link in the description below on how to do that. So t click Control Alt T, and you should be in cross. Now type shell clear and paste the command. Click enter. Enter your password if you have one. I mean, you pro if you're new to cross, you probably never have set up a password before. But now, what we can do is sudo crutin and it will run. But this is not what we want to do. We want to specify specific release and specific information on how we want to do it. So we're going to do sudo crutin dash all, which specifies the release version. And we're going to say focal. Considering the fact that you want the most updated version of Ubuntu, Ubuntu 20.04, you would type focal, focal. You could also do bionic and um, trusty and other things, but those are a bit old. If you don't do slash all focal, it would automatically install um, Xenial. And then dash T, and we want to specify what what type of GUI for, for the first option first, first option in slash t dash t and we want to use you can use any like genome or unity or any but i'm going to use x face because that's the most lightweight version and you could also do x but um this, what this basically does it it's it it like gives you an it gives us it creates it it can run the um it can run the fruit inside a app. So like the Linux would X face terminal would be not the terminal GUI would be inside the app. So basically you can switch between your um, Chromebook and your Linux, your Linux, uh, Linux terminal um, very quickly. So you can easily just open them together. It's much better for productivity. All you gotta do is download this Chrome extension called Crouton Integration, and that's basically all you need to do. But for the simplicity of this video, I'm not going to do that. Now, download it. I already have a crew, I have actually like four crews already installed on this my Chromebook, so um, I'm going to specify the name. You could do this if you want, but it's your choice. I'm just going to call it Tech Tips of the Day. X space. I'm just gonna copy that name because it's gonna be important later. You would get this winning, but it doesn't really matter. You should ignore it. It just basically says that um, Focal is an unsupported release. Now that the installation process is finished, now we gotta specify our username for all Linux. I'm just gonna call it 
tech tips of the day. Uh, you also need to specify a password and confirm that password. And as you can see, the in uh, entire installation system is finished. As you can see, this is some important info, but I'll talk about that later. So don't worry yet, just yet. So now what we're gonna wanna do is sudo enter crude. Um, remember how before I said that I have multiple crudes. This you should you you should you shouldn't need to do this if this is your first time installing a crude, which it probably is if you're watching this tutorial. But you don't need to. But after maybe you might want different crudes, like one for Unity, one for Genome, and maybe different releases of Ubuntu. But all all you gotta do is do dash n and specify a, na a different name for each one and this was the name I had before. Click enter, put in your Linux password, and we're in. So this is actually Ubuntu. As you can see we have sudo app get update. It all works. But the reason why you came to this video oh, there we go. The reason why you came to this video is because you wanted to see a GUI and how to do about it. Here's how you do that. Start X face X face four. Hopefully my screen recording app can see this, but this is the Linux entire Linux system running. As you can see, I can open the file manager, the terminal, and type anything, sudo app get update. And this is a cool part. You can easily switch between the two operating systems, Chrome OS and Linux, by typing, by clicking Control Alt Shift, uh, back air, front air forward arrow to go back to Chrome OS, Alt Shift, back arrow to go back to Linux. Now that's all I have for this video. Hope you liked it, and you could read more about Ubuntu on the um github page but uh if you like the video make sure to discuss, subscribe like and hit the bell icon below oh yeah one note before i end this video if once i start editing the screen screen recording if i don't see the um see the uh linux i would create i'm gonna create another video showing edit um showing me controlling it but if you try it for yourself it will and following this tutorial step by step it will definitely work i promise you that so once again make sure to subscribe like and hit the bell icon and share this video with anyone like thanks for watching